Hey, welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be doing my oh, you downstairs, downstairs here already. Oh no no no! I just gotta put on some blush and I'll be ready. Lines, you got a fresh face. You ain't ready. That's the look I'm doing today. My go-to zero minutes, zero time look. Okay, it's very easy, very quick. Usually takes you about ten minutes. Yeah. So let's just get straight into the video. I hope you enjoy it. Lighting keeps changing. I'm wearing white jeans, this is not smart. <laughs> Protection is better than cure. Is that the saying? I don't even know if that's the saying. Way too many times am I like, yeah, 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 I'm almost ready. Oh, you just down the road. All right, all right, yeah, I'll see you in a second. Boom, I have no makeup on. I need to whack something on quickly. I need to make it look like I didn't just lie. I need to make it look like I made the effort to get ready in time. So this is what this look is gonna be. So let's get straight into it. I've already done my eyebrows cause ain't nobody got time for that on camera. So I'm gonna start off by spot concealing with the NYX Full Coverage Concealer in Beige. Now that that's done, I'm gonna take my Chanel foundation. I feel so bougie with this, like, oh my god. Vita Lumiere Chanel foundation in the shade beige, 40 beige. Intensity 2, don't know what that means. And a lot of the time I think big brands, you're just paying for the name, you're not really paying for the formula. It is really watery by the way, so I use quite a bit. Oh, it's running. You're not paying for the formula, you're paying for the brand. But this foundation is actually very, very good. Sometimes I even touch myself Imagining your pleasure, baby I'm going to put some information here about the product because the leaflet does go into quite a lot of detail and I think if you're buying a new foundation especially one that seems like a bit of an investment like double wears £30 £9 extra is not too much but either way a new foundation is a bit of an investment so I like to know all the information. We've got my whole routine. Contouring. I'm just going to skip through that because you lot have seen the contour before. Hula bronzer again. As you can see, it is very loved by me. Then I take this lovely blending brush by Crown again. You can see the bristles are a lot longer. It really allows you to get into the crease. And I take my favourite lovely suntan bait bronzer powder. I always use on my eyes. You've seen it before. So when I'm doing my crease, I always have the bristles upwards, not into my eye, but upwards. That way it makes my crease higher than it really is. Okay, welcome to my face and into the crease. You can see the bristles are going high up in my crease. The bulk of the brush is going into the crease. And that's how you get it perfectly blended up. Next, I'm gonna take my eyeliner. At this stage, I don't have time for none of this. None of this. I literally put it in my eye, close my eye, and rub. So I put it in. So I put some in the lash line. This part does not need to be tidy because I'm gonna smudge it all out anyway. So I put more than enough. Then I take my blending brush. Blending. Smudging, a smudging brush, and I smudge out that whole bottom line. Then I'm gonna go into my, I 
eyeshadow palette. Take any eyeshadow palette. Take the blackest black that you can get. There we go. Now at this point, this is what really pulls the look together. It makes it look like you really try. You know damn well you don't try. Now you're gonna take what's on your brush, make sure there's not too much. I need my mirror for this. And you're just going to slightly wing it out and bring it into the lower lid, the upper lid, the lower part of your upper lid. I don't know what to call it. You'll see. So you're gonna wing it out a little bit. Smudge it and onto your lower lid. As you can see, I'm only using what's left on the brush. I'm not going in for extra. I'm not making it too dramatic. I'm just trying to make it look like I tried. But I know damn well I didn't have the time to try. So I'm going to take my big blending brush again. And I'm just going to blend that all together. And that's my eyes literally done. After that, I'll put some mascara. I left my mascara in the bedroom. Caitlin! What? Can you get the mascara, please? I forgot it too. Boys in blue, all I need is Nina, Nina. Oh, Thank you. Then I'm taking my L'Oreal. Full Slash Superstar. It has the primer on one end and then it has the mascara with the fibers in at the other end. We don't have time for the primer. The man are outside waiting for you. They think you're ready. So we're just going to take the mascara. It is a very good mascara by itself. Don't always need the primer. The, dog, the dog's thirsty now. The dog wants to drink now. We're just going to do a mascara. Lips. So I'm gonna take my Kiko lip liner in 504. I slightly need to sharpen it. But we don't have time. They're outside waiting for you. You don't have time. So we're just gonna take our lip liner. Take some lip gloss. It's much easier to maintain lip gloss throughout the day than it is anything else. So whack on some lip gloss. And then next. We're pretty much done. We don't have time for eyelashes because we didn't wanna we didn't wanna be on time. So we don't get the luxury of eyelashes at this stage. We've got time for a little highlight. We've always got time for a highlight. I'm gonna take sleek highlight in so so tice soltis but is this one in my nose, Whoa, love that nose. It's a bit in the middle. Just in it. There we go. My only issue with this foundation, I don't know if it's me, it sinks into my laughter lines very quickly. Like under eye creasing. Not a problem, just my laughter lines. I think it might just be me. Am I laughing too loud for the foundation? No. I put the plant here thinking it's gonna look cute, but it's just a nuisance, really. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like, subscribe if you haven't, because listen, I've been in Ireland for two weeks and I've already filmed like three videos. I've got so much editing to do when I get back. There's just going to be, the consistency is going to be banging, I promise you. So subscribe to keep up with all of that. And yeah, leave a comment. I love to see comments. I love to hear what you thought about the video. So yeah, let me know. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you liked the look. Let me know if you try it out. I feel like the eyes are the key part of this look. You just smudge under your eyes, smudge it out a little bit, pull it into a wing. It really looks like you tried a lot more than you did. So let me know if you tried the look. Let me know if you like the look. 
subscribe, comment. I love to see comments underneath the videos. It makes me so happy. Uh, yeah, thank you. See you later.